Vou peneirar. Aqui, aqui. He was asking me permission if he could actually open the door to his own car. That's how polite and sweet the people of Bangalore are. Hey Savan Squad, what is happening? Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at the Savant Life and also search for my page on Facebook and give it a big old thumbs up. Alright guys, the time is uh, 5.21 in the morning, it's a Sunday. So we're all good to go. It's about 5.45 in the morning and I think I might be just a little delayed but uh, now I have to hustle. The mandatory clip in the lift. We just have to get this one, don't we? If you're doing a KC and a Mumbai technical shot. Except the lifts in New York are definitely much better but we have to make do with what we can. Look at that. All right, so there is a slight change in plan, actually. We were supposed to be meeting up at uh, Janagar, but I think, you know, I've got to take this one on me. I got delayed, and as a result, we are now going to be meeting. I love how that console comes up. Even after all of those years, even with all of the fancier bikes that have come in, I still love looking at the console of my FC16. This dude is an OG. Okay, so just to tell you guys a little more about uh, the friends that I'm meeting up with today They're actually my really really old friends from college And uh, we used to hang out a lot. We used to go for bike rides together and all of that uh, In fact, there was a when I wasn't even motor vlogging back in I think 2014 or something There's a video that I'd made of the three of us doing a trip to Chikmagalur and I didn't have a GoPro or anything of that kind I don't think anybody was motor vlogging back then but I just shot this video with a cell phone camera holding it in one hand and I wouldn't recommend that to anybody today of course if you haven't seen that video I will link it up somewhere over here on the screen and maybe leave it in the description section as well so feel free to check it out but these two guys are old friends of mine like I said uh, we used to be thick as thieves we still are I'd like to believe uh, I don't know if they would like if I give out their names online so let's just call them S and D and uh, I'm gonna be catching up with S and D after a really long time I'm excited and uh, hopefully the breakfast at Vina stores that is what we're planning to do lives up to all of the hype I mean I've been there a couple of times and I really liked it but um, you know never on a Sunday morning never when it's supposed to be super incredibly crowded look at that auto guy bad boy look at me good boy waiting for a red light even at 6.30 in the morning, as you all should. But now it's green, so let's go. Don't you just love the roads of Bangalore? Bring on anything, Bombay, Chennai, Pune, Delhi, whatever, Calcutta, nothing compares to this. Nama Bengaluru in all of its glory. This is one of my favorite areas of the city. For those few who are not from here, for those few who might not recognize it, we just crossed the Anil Kumble Circle over there, and this is the Jules D. Paragon signal. Over there is Kaban Park, and over here on the right hand side is the Chinnaswamy Stadium. Yes, this is where Chris Gale hits all of his sixes that go sailing straight out of the stadium into somewhere over here. Pretty cool, eh? Oh, look at this. I love what they've done with this little thing over here. It's a traffic island and uh, they've made the most of it. Looks very artsy and nice. I could get used to something like that.
and I can see my friends are already here. It turns out that it took them lesser time to get from Janagar to here than it did for me to get from Koramangla to here. Doesn't this R15 look great? So after that mini reunion, it's time for us to get going. I'm actually thinking if we go to Veena stores first before we go to Sankey Tang, there might be less of a crowd over there. By the way, what you see over here on the left hand side is the Karnataka golf course. That's La Meridian right there. That's Winsamana. There is Sankey Tang. I don't know if my GoPro is doing justice to it, but just take my word. It looks really beautiful. So here we are and I think we lucked out because there's hardly a crowd over here considering how early it is in the morning. Okay, so we're here at Vina Stores and uh, Ashley decided to come down to another lane and park the bikes over here so that they would be safe and secure. And I think the plan really worked of coming down early over here because there are not too many people. It's only about 7 in the morning, so I can't wait to go and get some delicious idlis. Now, my friends are probably going to be annoyed a little bit about me vlogging. But then again, I'm going to try and be as non-intrusive as possible. So, hopefully we'll be able to do a little bit of both. Now, that is Vina's stores. As you can see, if you've not been here, it's one of those really famous places of Bangalore. MRF shot in the background, you know. I'm very proud of my framing and this vara that we have. Mm. The idli was just okay, but the vadas are delectable. These varas don't even have sambar, but you don't miss that sambar for a second because the crispiness and how well these varas have been fried, world class. He was asking me permission if he could actually open the door to his own car because I've actually kept my camera on the top of his car. That's how polite and sweet the people of Bangalore are. Jai Karnataka! 